Number 10. Runners go. Hall hits this one, a base hit into center field. One run will score, and it'll put runners on the corners. BYU. No, two runs coming home. The throw to the plate. Not in time. He's safe. But they are going to get Austin Hall in second for two outs. I thought they were going to hold runners in the corners, but Van Vance Law bringing them home. Stephen Wells scores all the way from first, and BYU takes a 7-4 lead. Number nine. Swings away. Mua chasing and makes the catch in left field. A diving catch by Christian Mua. Number eight. 12 hits, time for Brugman. Hits this one into center field, floating into right. Kincaid makes the catch, here comes Wolf on the tag. Throw in time, and Wolf beat him again. BYU's up 1-0. The RBI sacrifice fly from Wes Gunther. It was a medium deep ball, and you look at it, he, just, he, he runs like a middle linebacker. Watch this slide, fade away and touches the base with his hands. That was what, that's what made him safe. Hustling all the way, fade away slide, touch it with your hand. Great slide, great hustle. Number seven. This has a drive to center. And flagged down by Stephen Wells. Well, maybe that defensive play will bring the bats to life. Bottom of the third coming up. Stephen Wells. Laying it out on the line for BYU. Number six. Full count now to David Edwards. Base pass empty. And a called strike three. Swung on a missed. Strike three to Colton Playa. Swung on strike three. Sixth strike out of the game for Chris Capper. He goes the distance with the complete game. BYU wins it 7-2, hands LMU its first loss in West Coast Conference play. Number five. 1-0 pitch to Peters, Paulson brings it home. This one blew foul. Whitney makes the catch and they're able to double him up. BYU gets out of the inning, Brock Whitney makes the catch in foul territory and makes the throw over to Paulson to get Harris's doubled up. Number four. Brock Whitney hits this one deep into the gap in left center field. Welch on his giddy up is going to come from third and score the go ahead run. The throw into third, not in time. It's a triple for Brock Whitney. An RBI triple gives BYU the 5 4 lead in the bottom of the eighth. Wow. You know, you talk about making the right call over there. Coach Vance Law puts in Welch at first base, and he was replacing Alex Wolf who got the single. Number three. Ground ball to second, Law scoops it up. The throw to second over to first, inning ending double play. Base is loaded and Mark Osling gets out of it. He's pumped up. Number two. Paulson has pitched very well. He had that one inning last inning where he gave a four runs, but prior to that, only one other a run. Herbst rips this one to right field. And caught. What a play by Jacob Brugman on the warning track. And what he did is he hit his head against the wall as he's coming down. Number one. Santa Clara one strike away from its first road win in West Coast Conference play. 2-2. Brugman hits this one high. Deep. Deep to left center, and go on a walk-off home run by Jacob Brockman. A walk-off grand slam, and BYU wins it 8-6. Wow. Unbelievable, Jacob Brockman. He's got great power. He just hasn't hit it out this year. He's got five triples, great speed, and you 
one strike away from being out of here, and Brooklyn hits a grand slam.